Seed color technology is changing. Today we're going to show you a brand new innovative product that is going to show you the neck and everything. You can see right through it. It's really cool. I'm Chris Montera and this is the Innovation Zone. As EMS providers, the most common thing that we splint is the neck and the back. I know I've been doing it 20 years and I've splinted more necks than backs than I have arms or legs. And, and if we really look at it as a splint, this is kind of the industry standard. We've been using this a long time. It's opaque, it's foam, and it's really hard, rigid plastic. So it, it, but it also, has, it also presents some problems and some perils for us. Most times after you put it on, you can't see what's going on. You can't check for JVD. You can't see if a wound under the neck is getting worse or better after you've applied pressure to it. So the risk really comes in when you open this up that you can move the patient's neck a little bit and that really presents a problem because every time you do this and you open it up to check for JVD or check a, check a wound, you have to then put it back on, reapply it, make sure that everything's in line, check the neuros, make sure that the patient can still feel and move everything and, and it just becomes annoying. So if there was something better out there that you could use that you could actually see, and I know that many times in my career I've wanted x-ray vision, so now I think I get that. So now there's clear collar. Obviously you can tell it's clear. It's really nice. It's, it's very hard, very rigid. It feels even more rigid than those, and I think it's actually a little bit more comfortable when you put it on. The, the nice thing is, since it's clear, I don't have to keep opening it up to check for JVD, to check a wound. I don't have all of the issues I have with the opaque collar. I can actually now see everything that's going on with the patient. I get them into the ER. The doc can look and see everything that I was talking about without then taking off the collar and again, presenting more risk. I love this device. I think that the other thing about it is, is that the, you can see through it. It's a, it, they have an adjustable version now, but they also have a pediatric version and a very small infant version and a tall neck version. So multiple sizes, or you can just carry one for the adjustable. So you have a choice. You can go clear, you can go opaque. With the opaque one, it presents a few problems. You have to open it up, check underneath it, see if the patient's JVD is getting worse, if the wound is not closing off and, and you haven't stopped the bleeding. You also present a problem because you're, you're always moving the patient's neck when this happens and then you have to reassess the neuros, you have to make sure everything, uh, that they can move all their limbs after you do it. So it, you're taking time away from treating the patient while you're using this. And then finally, once they get to the ER, the doc wants to rip this off. But now you have a clear choice. You have something you can see right through. You can check for JVD, you can check the wound without removing the collar, without presenting additional problems for the patient. And quite honestly, it's rigid, it's nice, it has a good feel to it. And I think that it's going to do a ni much nicer job for the patient to remind them not to move their neck. And once you get to the ER, the doc can go, yep, that's exactly what's going on and move them right to the CAT scan or the, or the x-ray department without needing to take this off and reassess the patient afterwards. So this is the clear collar. And I'm Chris Montero for the Innovation Zone.